Hey guys, if you make a common mistake, you may end up spending thousands of dollars on repairs that you may actually not need. Make sure to stay until the end, we'll explain what it is. Hey guys, welcome back to World Mechanics. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. And today will be a super helpful video to any of you guys having a Dodge Ram that generation here from year 2013 to year 2018. If you need to find where the engine computer relay is located, which relay you need to check, or you can guys buy cheap parts, tools, fuses, relays at a good price, quick shipping. That way you do not waste money and time. Why guys, it's always a good idea to test fuses and relays. All that will be covered absolutely free for your convenience. Make sure to stay until the end. So, let us tell you a little bit about us guys. Every single car we get here at the garage, we try to make at least two to 300 free repair videos. We take them completely apart, we show you how to fix anything like engines, transmission, codes, fuses, bodywork, all that stuff. Why we do all that? Because our mission at the shop is to save you as much money as we can. All we need in return, please subscribe to the channel, like the video. On this channel guys, specifically, we will be making a video about every single fuse, every single relay on that Dodge Ram and let's say you're in the middle of nowhere, your fuel pump fuse goes bad, all we have to do, find our video, watch it for a minute or two, replace that fuse, you're back on the road. So we do that guys to help you as much as we can. Also, we have more than 14,000 free repair videos on our YouTube channels that can save you thousands of dollars in future repairs. So let's start on it now. The engine computer relay where you can expect to find it we will guys demonstrate on this generation Dodge Ram right here so what do we need to do let's go ahead and open the hood once we guys open the hood here on the driver's side you will find your car battery in front of it that's your engine fuse box main fuse box press these two tabs lift up it will open on the inside you will find the main engine fuse box with a layout like this one before we continue let's explain quickly why it's always a good idea to test fuses and relays Guys, it's very important to always test your fuses and relays. Why? Sometimes you may think you have a good fuse, guys. It's hard to tell. Look at those fuses, right? And sometimes, okay, you pull the fuse. Okay, I'm going to get the fuse puller and I'm going to remove one fuse. I want to, I want to show you on that 20 amp fuse. Sometimes it's very unclear if that fuse is burned or not. You may not clearly see it. So always, guys, test them because if you don't test the fuse, you assume it's good, you end up spending money time and diagnostics for problems that do not exist guys so you can just waste your money and time always test your fuses always test relays we will put links in the description of the video below where you can find guys a video for testing a fuse and testing a relay that will explain everything that you need to do if you guys need to buy any parts, tools for your Dodge Ram, fuses, relays at a really good price, quick shipping, that way you do not waste money and time, we're going to put a link in the description of the video below for your convenience, please check it out. So guys, for the engine computer, one relay will need to be checked. Please guys, make sure you stay until the end, we want to give you one good advice, that way you do not end up being stuck in the middle of nowhere like it happened to us. The relay for the engine computer is known as relay number 5 and we're talking about that relay right here. That's the relay that you will need to check for the engine computer of Dodge Ram. So guys, you have all kinds of different fuses and relays. Some of those are very specific, they're hard to find, especially if you're in a small town or in the middle of nowhere. One time we needed a replacement, we couldn't find one and we were stuck in the middle of nowhere for a few days until we got a shipment on the internet, guys. So keep some spares in your glove box for peace of mind. Hopefully, guys, the video will be helpful. Thank you for watching and see you guys next time.